today in this video we'll learn how to make a this type of simple contact form page using elementor first we need to go to our admin panel and here hover on this plugin and click on add new and search here animator then install this animator plugin and active this plugin okay then we need to go to here like create on new page hover here page and click on add new page put a title and here click on main then content layout select this full width and click on title then disable the title click on published then click on edit with elementor now we need to click add section C click on this section then select this two column section and click on here then search here load to load load t like this load t drag and drop here click this plus icon then select this contact as json i'll provide this json file in video description so check my video description below i'll provide this so download this and upload here upload this json file and select insert media then you will see this preview and we need to add one form okay first we are taking a header and change this contact tct contact us then click on style click on change the color and typography click on em and increase the size uh, four is best and again here search on form then here the default elementor form drag and drop here then click on this name duplicate the name and again click on this name button then you, will, you need to change the column width select 50 and again name change 50 and here change the type into number and label change number and we need to change the placeholder if you want to change this you can change it or if you don't want to change it uh, as you wish so let's change this input your number okay or i just copy this input your text and go to name and input your name again the submit okay again the uh, email option input the placeholder okay i think it's done if you want to add any new item click on here and you need to change the type which type uh, you want to add here okay if you want to add any kind of email or uh, url telephone radio as a wish i don't want to need any new one here then submit button if you want to change this i want to change the text submit and if you want to change the size you can change here the column width change if you want to change that you can change this uh, and here the alignment and i don't want to need any change here and here after submit if you want to add the redirect button redirect that means if you go to in my website then if i fill up the form fill up the form then we'll see the changes submit it and then it will redirect the new paths it's this call redirect okay if you add any redirect and they'll uh, if you add any option here then you will see the new option if i uh, delete this redirect then you will see the redirect option gone if you add then you will see the redirect but option and uh, you need to add the redirect th which page you want to redirect uh, paste the link okay so i don't want to change here okay it's fine and here our email and here our branding email and our name change here your website name i just input my website name here and uh, additional additional if you want to change the custom text that means some seconds ago that means if i input the name or number 
okay this is this is basically this is the additional information like custom masses okay this is custom masses if you want to change this you can change here easily here the style button if you want to uh, change any color or any box width or size you can change here so i want to change this button color click on this button and here as you can see the button color select your black then you will see the change and i have to change the text color white and typography click rm increase this okay yeah, it's it's looking fine now 1.5 it's looking fine and here if you want to decoration any uh, decoration style you can do this i don't want to change anything else here if you want to change masses color you can do this here a lot of option check all options and now we'll check the preview okay it's uh, looking now this and we need to check the responsive mode as you select the mobile then you will see it's responsive but this takes we need to change the typography increase this change okay it's looking now fine as you can see it's looking fine now add option okay desktop mode okay and click on the subject yes it's done if if we reload this website again then we'll change we'll see that changes okay okay we're seeing these changes but here as you can see the header and uh, contact name so we need to add some uh, margin click on the section button click on the section button click on this advance and click on this percent link value turn off the link value and 5% okay and click on the subject button reload my website okay now it's looking fine thanks for watching this video if you like this video click on this like button or if you new in my channel please subscribe